all the things, including childcare, is actually going to be better off net of this budget after all. Well, I'll, I'll give way to the honourable gentleman if he can confirm that the childcare promise, which was supposed to be happening this summer, has been put off, has been shelved now at least to 2017. Is that correct? I'll give way to the honourable gentleman. I'll give way to no, it's a debate. I'll give way to the honourable gentleman. He wanted to talk about these case studies. He thinks it's important. Order on both sides. I cannot hear, Mr. Leslie. I think the Secretary of State has shot himself in the foot. He should read the small print of the Chancellor's own announcements because without without much fanfare, they did they did leave that childcare decision. I haven't given. I haven't finished. I haven't. Finished. I think the whip needs to relax a little bit. But I will say that we can't have two people standing up for this much. Well, as much as it may be entertaining, I'm only going to take one. Christopher Lesley. Well, it is quite entertaining to see the Secretary of State struggle in this way. Can he? Wait, wait for it. Wait, wait. Can the Secretary of can the Secretary of State confirm? Oh. Jacob Rees-Mogg. In order for the Chadwick Chancellor to say he will give way to the Secretary of State and then not give way. <laughs> oh, 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 order, oh, order. A constitutional expert within this house knows it's not a point of order. Christopher Lesley. I, of course, am relishing giving way to the Secretary of State, but he has to answer this question. We've given him a bit of time to think of an answer now, but he 